when you fly, you often check your luggage at the airport and hope you'll be reunited with it when you arrive at your destination. Luggage can go missing for a day or two and it's usually recovered, but what happens if an airline loses your luggage for good? Here's Pat Foran and Consumer Alert. Pat. Nathan and Michelle, a woman went on a Mexico vacation and her luggage arrived without any problems, but coming home, her bag was not put on a plane. A suitcase is considered lost after 21 days, but three months later, she still hasn't received any compensation. Is it frustrating? 100%. Is it fair? No. Rosemary Wysocki of Kitchener and a friend flew to Cancun, Mexico in early February. They had a great trip, but when they flew home, Wysocki's suitcase didn't show up. I asked the guy if he could go back and look for the, any extra luggage, and he said, no, that was it. Wysocki says what followed has been a frustrating process, trying to get compensation from Flair Airlines for her lost luggage. She's been asked to provide receipts she no longer has for things that were in her suitcase. They're making it sound like I lost the luggage. When I paid for them to put the luggage on the carousel, and it didn't show up where it was supposed to. She says her baggage was filled with expensive items she'll now have to replace. I had a Dyson hair dryer, which is almost $700. I had, you know, $350 flat iron on there, plus all your toiletries, makeup. When it comes to airline delays and cancellations, sometimes the compensation owed can be confusing. But an air passenger rights advocate says with lost luggage, the rules are simple. From the moment you hand over your baggage to the airline as a checked baggage, until the moment they put it back into your hands, the airline is liable for your baggage. Baggage is deemed lost after 21 days. The airline is liable for $2,300 and must also refund the baggage fee. After Wysocki contacted CTV News, we reached out to Flair Airlines and a spokesperson said, in addition to continuing our efforts to locate the missing bag, we have taken immediate action by refunding the bag fee and providing compensation owed. So Wysocki was just paid for the lost suitcase, the baggage fee, and a travel credit for almost $2,700, which was good news for her. Shout out to CTV News, the best there is. If it wasn't for you guys pushing, I don't think I would have got anything by now. Thank you, CTV. And more flyers are now using air tags or other tracking devices to monitor where their luggage is. And more people are switching to carry-on luggage to make sure their suitcase remains with them at all times. On your side, I'm Pat Foran. If you have a consumer story idea, email us at alert at ctv.ca.